morning we're going to take a look at uh, my customer Ryan's, it's, it's his uh, S10 plow truck rear drive shaft. Um, it had been here once before a few years ago, um, probably, I, I'm certain it was during the COVID, so, uh, judged on the u joints and we'll talk about that in a second. But uh, so there is some history here. Uh, it, it came to me the first time because it had a well joke ripped up, ripped apart, and I don't know, screw joints are smashed, failed, and you know that, that kind of stuff. So I put a well joke on it. Put uh, it had greasable U joints in it, uh, in their Mechanics 3R, and I normally run 795 staff tight. So I'm that's why I'm saying it was during the COVID because there was a period we couldn't get those uh, 795s a while so I'm guessing it was during that period anyway so U-joint failed again on him and he put another U-joint in it and then it did it again and uh, damaged the pinion yoke and some carnage so we did some more due diligence on this and as close as we can tell it was probably three quarters of an inch to an inch too long Probably not the original one for the truck. I mean, it's just a truck he bought used. Maybe somebody jammed it in there, you know, just just because it does fit. You know, just because you can get it in there, it can lead to problems. Uh, there are the rear springs weak, causing the due axle wrap. Yeah, maybe that, you know. So we had a few items on the list. We uh, corrected the length. I did shorten it three quarters of an inch. And uh, it's got a pair of 795 snap tights in it again. Uh, no, well, actually, for the first time, because I didn't have them before, apparently, because I didn't use them. Um, so 795 snap tights, shortened at three quarters of an inch. It's tuned up balance wise. And uh, so that's, that's running 2500, 267. That's about 2800 right, right there. Zero at the transfer case. Zero at the rear axle. Um, so, we're going to get this back to Ryan. Um, it is Christmas. Just as Christmas Friday, uh, basically. So, uh, it's Christmas is Monday this year. So, it's Friday morning. We're going to get this back to him. So, we can get his truck back in. We have no snow. It's supposed to be 40 degrees over the weekend. But, uh, Merry Christmas, everyone. And, uh, Thanks for watching.